Alrighty guys, so I started putting the roof up. Sorry I didn't bring you out earlier. Um, I've got the 4x4s up, got the main part of the frame up. And then over here, um, I've actually got the first couple of roof panels up there. Um, it's kind of hard to see. Uh, I'll take you up there in just a minute. Uh, but right now I've kind of got them clamped in place. Quick view of the lag bolts used to hold the bottom of the uh, for one of the four by fours. Alrighty, here we are um, up on the deck. You can kind of see some of the work here, putting that together. Um, horrible lighting again. Um, as you can see, I've got the first bit there. I've got the little, uh, they call it roof ends, uh, the little ridge stuff so it doesn't flap or let uh, stuff come in as it kind of overlaps the other roof there a little bit. Um, I have it sloped slightly more than the roof up above. Um, that way we can sheet some of the wind up and over. So in addition to being able to uh, sheet a little bit more wind up, um, it gives me a little bit better angle um, as far as when the uh, sun hits and my solar noon. So I'm pitched a little bit to the uh, west and then I'll have to pitch a little bit south on the panels once I get them up on top as well. Alrighty guys, so I finally got the uh, roof all the way up. Uh, I've got a little piece right over there I've got to cut down. Um, and looking at the gutter more, I've got to actually put a couple more uh, gutter screws in there, replace these gutter nails. Um, they're kind of pulling out a little bit and it's causing a little bit of water to come back behind the, uh, um, the gutter and the uh, fascia board there. Um, I'm working on cutting off this last little bit right there that was just like uh, about an inch of overhang. Uh, but from there, next it will be um, putting up the panels and the uh, rack for the panels up above it. Alrighty guys, so I've got six of the uh, eight batteries that I was originally shooting for, which is good. Um, I'm getting ready to uh, put them in the box and kind of get the box um, and everything in place ready to go. And I'm going to be showing you guys that here in, in the near future. Um, as before, we've got the uh, positive wire partially run. The positive is going to go in on that side, and I think I'm going to do the negative in this corner. Um, you know, just running corner from corner. Um, that way you're pulling equally from, from the batteries anyways, the best you can. Alrighty guys, so getting ready to build some cables. I've got, uh, you know, got the clippers out there. I've got the new uh, on and off switch over there. Got my cable there, whole bunch of terminal connectors, the uh, little Timco wire crimpers, and the heat gun. So, it's about time to start building some wires and putting some batteries together. Also got to give a shout out to uh, Yankee 4. Um, I'm putting battery cables together and uh, listen to his live cast, so... If you guys haven't checked out Yankee 4, check him out and his live cast, which he's going to be doing on Mondays now. Alrighty guys, so I've got the uh, first set of cables done. I'm going to need one more of these eventually when I get the uh, other two batteries. Um, so I'm using blue um, and a, a wrap on basically the uh, black cable. Um, so the uh, blue is just going to identify where my cables are connecting the batteries in series, so the uh, positive to the negative. Um, hence the uh, red and black on each end of the blue. Um, so on this side over here, this will be my connection for all the batteries in parallel. And this side over here will be all the uh, negatives in parallel. Alrighty guys, so I've got the uh, series cables run. I've got the uh, parallel cables run. There's an extra parallel down there and I haven't finished building the uh, last um, negative parallel cable. Um, Almost done with this set of negative parallel cables. I've got to put the uh, heat shrink on the ends there and then attach them over there. Um, still listening to a Yankee 4. He's uh, been great entertainment while I've been building the wires anyways. Alrighty guys, so I've got uh, the batteries all set up there. Everybody's uh, linked up in series and parallel and We've got a decent little uh, 12 volt battery bank going on. Um, looking forward to getting the next two batteries. I've got the other two pieces cut. Um, next is gonna be, uh, you know, connecting the uh, power up to the uh, 
inverter as well as the uh, charge controller. And from there, I'm giving it a quick test run um, just with the uh, power that's in the batteries. Um, and then from there, um, you know, as we've been talking, I've got that solar roof that's done. Um, I do need to make a, a, a rack for all of the uh, panels. And from there, it's putting the panels up and uh, connecting with the charge controller and then start making some power. About time.